This is a job we are just finishing in Scaries. It used to have a hipped roof on it here like the neighbours, uh, but we extended the gable across, extended the ridge across and built the gable up um, to look like um, a gabled house like that at the end of the road there. And show you the inside now. Okay, inside now we replaced all of the existing handrail on the stairs. So put a new pine square posts and spindles. And up to the landing, that's the underside of the attic stairs. Some new stairs going up. So here standing on the landing, the original landing, and you can see a glass panel there which is letting in considerably more light than the window on the roof because, or the window on the wall because there's a big window the far side of that in the roof that's casting an awful, an awful lot of light in. So we had this bulk coat over our head as we walk, over, walk up the stairs. That's the wall there, but that's now space in this little room here. I'll show you that room first actually. So this little home office. So built-in work desk across the way, so there's no support or structure visible underneath, it's all just built into the wall. Thermostatically controlled radiator. Great big UK Velux window with a flat head on it to get extra head space, because it's kind of necessary in here. That's the top of the bulkhead I showed you downstairs, and um, it's just extra space like for printers and stuff like that. And that's the glass panel, an opaque glass panel, so the light from this window, straight down through there onto the stairwell on the landing. Worked out very nice. Access to storage areas in here. Now, um, there's a little storeroom in here for easier access to storage space. Just for more regular storage. And then the main room. Main room has our couple UK like Velux windows with no protrusion in between them. Normally you'd have a pillar going up along here, which is obviously a bashing your head hazard. And we have level heads. Normally the head would come perpendicular down off the window to here, whereas by me putting the level head in, we get an extra an off layer of extra head space and then just bring the bottoms down flush rather than out perpendicular again, just to make maximum space. So these are the white UK08 Velux windows with the white Velux blackout blinds. And these are a simpler type, they're not the duo blind that I do in a lot of jobs. They're about half the price. Um, wall ready for a telly over there. Big thermostatic controlled radiator. Won't need that often because it's very well insulated up here. This has a plywood floor ready to be carpet or laminated. That's it.